for today's video I'm going to be attempting something a little bit out of my comfort zone. I've got a cake display stand which is primarily designed to keep cakes fresh with a glass dome on top and the board which the cake or baking sits on has unfortunately got quite a large crack there, a small one there and another crack there and more alarmingly we can actually move this section the lower part of it so we've got a bit of gluing to do and the, the problem is with this being a, a circular object is how to best glue it so I've came up with a few ideas I want to share with you so my first thought thinking along traditional lines is sash cramps a pair of these pinch it up either side and see what we can achieve with these I do have another idea in mind which I will get to after we've looked at the merit of this repair possibility. So what I'm going to do is just have a trial run just to see. I've got the sash cramps in place, blocks of wood either side to hopefully prevent any damage. And we're just going to gently tension these in turn and see what happens. This clamp's riding up already, so I've got a bit of a problem there. Let's see how viable this is. Now, that's not going to work. So I think we'll adjust the blocks. So we've now place the blocks upended, and we'll just see if we can tighten anything up. Seem to keep riding this block. Yeah, I think I can see where this is going. I don't think this is the way to do this. So we'll have a little rethink. So I've tried several configurations, messed around a bit, bit of experimentation, and this cake board. What happens is you just apply a bit of tension this end. And it just tries to jump in the air, so we do have a problem. I'm going to show you my other idea I have had, which should hopefully repair this cracked cake board. So in my regular job, I deliver to a place which um, I can basically help myself to these ratchet straps. So what I've done, I've formed a loop with a strap circular going round the board with a view to applying some circular force. So we'll have a little move around and we'll apply some tension to this. You can see the, the, the big gap there. It's uh, just starting to close up because I haven't yet tensioned it up. So we'll apply some tension. So here we are in my rather congested garage and uh, We've applied some tension. In order to do it, I had to put the base of the ratchet strap in a vise. Um, you could use a bit of leverage if you don't have a vise. But generally speaking, I think we're doing quite well. We've closed the gap to a reasonable amount. Hopefully it will um, glue. And I'm quite pleased with that. So we'll back everything off and apply the, uh, the wood glue. So I've got some wood glue, I'm using Gorilla Wood Glue. It does say on it, for the toughest jobs on planet Earth. So hopefully, I don't think that's too far off the mark and hopefully it will work. So I've got a cocktail stick. The plan is to work it in all the nooks and crannies. So we'll get some glue on and then we'll uh, see if it works. Hopefully it will. I'm going to cheat and uh, just unscrew the top just to give me direct access so I don't really fancy uh, messing around with this applicator. And then we'll make a start on the worst part, which is uh, the bit that gave up when I applied the sash cramp, so we'll work plenty of glue in, in this crack here. 
So I've spent quite a bit of time working the wood glue in to all the crevices. We're going to give it a quick wipe down. I've even filled a few of the smaller gaps just to see what happens. I did it both sides. And we're going to cramp everything up and we'll see how much glue squishes out of it. Well, the squishiness started. Um, I've got an old cloth. I'm just going to use that to remove the excess glue as we go. So I've got it nice and even. I've tried, you've got to keep this central, which is a bit of a challenge. And also keep everything square on the ratchet strap, strap side of things. And also hold the board upright. So there's a lot going off. If you get the slightest thing out of square, it it wants to go in its own direction, which I think it's trying to slightly, but we may get that. One more click. Oh, there's a lot of force on that. These ratchet straps, incidentally, are rated in the region of two ton. Um, conventionally, five ton is a bit more available, but beggars can't be choosers in this case. Doing okay so far. See, we've filled the crack there quite satisfactorily. I'm really going to put a bit more effort on this side rather than the opposing side so this is the display side of the cake board I'll give a quick wipe on the rear and hopefully when uh, it's set which should take 24 hours things should be good I might just see there's just a tiny little crack I'm just gonna see if I can apply a bit more force to take that up well I struggled a bit we got one more click out of it which was beneficial to the job as we've uh, displaced some more wood glue which is excellent we're now getting things as tight as required oh, I'm really pleased with this so the next thing we have to do is patiently wait it says on the Gorilla Glue 30 minutes for the initial bond 24 hours to reach full strength so I'm in absolutely no rush to uh, undo what I've done at this stage we'll just have a further clean up and we'll wait 24 hours and see the end result so we're now a little over 24 hours um, yeah around 27 hours so we'll release this and see if everything stays in place or it just springs back into it cracked position I don't know it's never been done before by me no, never been done by anybody but we need to find out Ooh, that is tricky I'm having a bit of a struggle to remove it probably because it's so tight but it is coming off the edges and so there's a bit of excess glue there we'll maybe take a sharp blade and carefully remove that working as safely as we can and the finished end result is one circular glued tight cake board and it's even still square as we put it on the table isn't that excellent well that was no piece of cake. Thanks for watching. Um, why not subscribe to uh, increase your knowledge of repair possibilities?